We spent six years together. You never once showed up for anything on time. It's hard to be on time for things you don't care about. Our wedding day? What about it? What do you want me to say, sir? Look, not that I don't love reminiscing about the past, but I have somewhere to be and I can't be late. So if you wouldn't mind handing over the code, I'd be very grateful. You know I can't do that. What if I asked really politely? Pretty please? No? Can't say I'm not relieved. That was me at my most polite. God knows where I'd have gone from there. Guess that only leaves me with one option then. Seb, there's no scenario in which this ends well for you. You know that. You know what these people are like. You know what they'll do if anything happens to me. I know you, Nessa. I know you wouldn't do it. What, kill you? I've done plenty of things people thought I couldn't do. I married you, didn't I? I've never pulled my weapon and not used it. Why would today be any different? As genetic editing tools go, I've never seen a more efficient method than the CRISPR-Cas9. And it's incredibly simple. Annoyingly simple, if you ask me. I mean, when Professor Steele told me about it, I couldn't believe I hadn't thought of it myself. Once you've targeted the section of DNA you wish to alter, the guide RNA is introduced. The guide RNA targets and latches on to the section of DNA you wish to alter. After that comes the Cas9. The Cas9 follows after the guide RNA and meets it, if you will, at the designated sequence, at which point it cuts across both sections of DNA and then it proceeds to... Sorry, sir. I got a bit carried away there, didn't I? Much as I'm enjoying how passionate you are about DNA, we're on quite a tight timeline here, Fiona. Of course, sir. Absolutely. I just need to know, can it work? Well, of course it can. Did you not see what I did with the mice? I don't care what it did to the mice, Fiona. I need to know if it can work on the girl. Sir, this method of genetic altering, though brilliant, is incredibly dangerous. We've no idea what could happen. Introducing a foreign protein into the body, into DNA, is life-threatening. It's also illegal. I'm not sure you've much of a leg to stand on when it comes to legal matters. Does the name Dr. Kisa mean anything to you? You will do this by tonight. And then the whole world need never know what you and Dr. Kisa did to that poor little boy. 